morning, everybody. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Thank you for coming to the opening of the Leisure My name is Joe Mancino. I'm the officer in charge of the Two of East Coast Conference. I want to thank all of you again for coming. Thank all of you again for coming. I want to thank the Long Beach Cluster people for coming. Some of them, we have manager of post office operations, Steve Nelson, Ben Sakamura, and Jerome Ryan. Please hold all your applause to the end. Uh, we have the manager of customer services, Florinda Bailey. Raise your hand, Florinda. Oh, there she there is. She is. We have Norma Park, who worked very hard on this, the manager of administrative services. She worked really hard to get this Way out here back for there. all of you. Pretty red hair. Oh, there she Terry is. Terry Martinez, the purchasing specialist. We have Pat Kelly, the retail specialist that helped make There's this look Pat. real nice for you. We have the postmaster of our neighboring city, Cypress, here, Nancy Shank. Hey, Nancy. Nice. Other members of the Long Beach Cluster, please raise your hand and thank all of you for your support. With me we also have George Brown, council member from Seal Beach. We have Bill Narang, the administrator here at Leisure World, who worked very hard to get this in. From the city we have, the city, we have Lee Wittenberg, the director of developmental services. And we have Jack Shelber, the city manager of Seal Beach. A lot of people worked very hard to get this in to help better serve the community. We handed out questionnaires at the post office and one of the things that we got a lot of from Leisure World was people suggesting that we put a post office in here. We got the people together that could do that. People worked real hard and success. Today it's here. One of those people that really helped was Mr. Bill Narang. And I'll have him say a few words. Thank you. I think it's been a wonderful experience to know that that is the future world of a benefit from this world. Of course, this would not be possible at all for any one of us at the Golden Rain Board of Directors and the mutual directors and residents who live here. And I know some residents who probably don't like the location of it to make sure that we can find a suitable location for this whole thing. The person who is responsible for leading the request to the post office and ultimately getting the approval from the Golden Rain Foundation Board of Directors here this morning with us and I want you to meet with him and I'm sure he is going to say a few words. Mr. Howard McCurdy who is the president of the Golden Rain Foundation Board of Directors. Those of us who have gone down to the post office, couldn't find a parking place, got stuck out there in the street in the traffic trying to get into that thing and then had to go in there and stand in line. We are going to appreciate this. But yes, we, we are. are. Yeah. Here, without a lot of confusion and trouble. Thank you. Yeah. I think Mr. Brown, you know, you all know, is yeah. council member. He was very instrumental in getting us a lot of help and giving us ideas and what we can do and working with the staff and his city officials to make sure this is safe and proper for your use. So Mr. Brown, you would like to say something? I'm not going to take a lot of time. All I want to do on behalf of the residents, because I'm also a resident here, I just want to thank the Postal Department for this fine project. I know we're all going to appreciate it. So on behalf of all of you, I want to thank the Postal Department. And on that note, we have cake, we have punch for you all, and if each of you will please help me with this heavy oh, pair yeah. of scissors. Yeah. We will cut the ribbon. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to open the post office so that you know you can come in and conduct business like that. He said now. today there's a special. You get two for 60, how much? Today we're having a special on stamps. You get two for 64 cents. Yeah. Thank you for coming. We are now open. Come on in and mail your letters.
can have one stamp. <laughs> yes. Oh, are they? Oh, my God. It's too late now. Yeah, they brought this down for the road. Yeah, we get yeah, paid. Where's the flag? Are there going to be two flies or one? I don't know. I don't know. They're going from the back, I think. Good evening, Mitch. Good evening. Isn't he handsome? Huh? Hell, I have a fan. What do you do is just the one where they drive to the one by the end here. Take that one out and put it here. I wonder how the parking is going to be out here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> It kind of depends on the man. Did you get a picture of the cake or what you got? Well, I like to just... Oh, yeah. That's good. Did you get your stamps already? Yeah. Wow. Uh, are they special? Yeah. Oh, I always get the soft feel. Uh-huh. <laughs> huh? They're the best for you. Oh, yeah. Those self, yeah. I have to eat my plate. My cake's gone. Hide it. <laughs> oh, boy. Is this ever a lesson? Oh, yes? <laughs> so you guys no. got your regular post no. office now? 
Yeah. Wait, did they pick four one in the center, huh? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Are you going to keep two people working? It depends. Oh, wow. so so we have a good value that probably will. Uh, 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 Oh, Boy, I like your air conditioning. Boy, it works well, doesn't it? Well, I'll say. Seven, eight, nine, ten, fifteen, and twenty. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Have a good day. Yeah. Yeah.